Tell us about Red 5 Pro. Yeah, so we're a, a, a company that enables uh, developers to build live streaming apps. Um, basically, uh, our, our biggest thing is to be able to do super low latency uh, live video streaming at scale. And we give developers the tools to be able to build out their own applications with this kind of infrastructure. Oh, so technological nerds. Buy your, buy your stuff because you're the well, creator. Well, you already pointed out our name is Red 5, so yeah, yeah, like the Luke Skywalker reference is strong with us, so yeah. So I sort of see you as like there's a bunch of nerds in a classroom and <laughs> you're giving them the crayons so that they can draw their pictures. Is that right? <laughs> yeah, except we're not using crayons, but yeah, similar kind of. Well, I mean, the yeah. metaphor works. <laughs> okay. You're for programmers, right? You give yeah, them the yeah, tools exactly. to do their programming. Absolutely. Just like you give little kids crayons. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, no, in this case, it's, uh, we're taking out some of the super hard stuff, the, the protocols and the, you know, getting the codecs right, the encoding, the decoding, and all of that, and just giving them tools that make it relatively easy to build out these uh, kind of live streaming apps, like, you know, almost like Facebook Live or, you know, Skype-style applications. But really, our, our biggest strength in it is in these, uh, in the ability to build out live broadcast applications, which, you know, get the latency down to under a second, many times under half a second of latency. Um, you know, part of our, um, you know, philosophy is that latency actually matters nowadays, especially with live broadcasts. Um, because uh, of just the way people use their phones and everything else nowadays, that people are getting texted about like a game uh, and by their friends, and maybe they haven't even seen the play yet, and they're being goaded that you know their their team just got a touchdown. They're like, what? <laughs> so I mean, there's all kinds of disconnects that happen nowadays because of the latency in typical live uh, video, um, and uh, we're actually addressing that problem. Wow, very interesting. Tell me about your background. How did you get into this? Um, well, we actually started this back in 2005. We were the first team to reverse engineer RTMP, which is the Flash video streaming protocol. And uh, we created an open source uh, server called Red5 uh, from that. And uh, since then, uh, we kind of saw the demise of Flash as a, a real opportunity. Um, and, you know, the alternatives to Flash were things like HLS and MPEG Dash, which are super high latent protocols. And, uh, you know, they were just creating these things which take 20 to 30 seconds and sometimes 40 seconds to delay between, the, you know, what happens here, you know, from either it's your device streaming it out or from a, a radio station like this streaming out and then what people actually are receiving on their devices. Um, and we saw that as an opportunity to actually make something that will work really well. And now we're using modern protocols like WebRTC to, to do this. 